Kill me before the war is over, will you? It appears that you are not the better man. Hello everyone, and welcome to another episode of Zareth Prevails, a Grand Arena Story. Folks, this is a really intense match. You don't really want to miss it, I don't think. There's a lot that is going into it. There are so many crazy counters. My opponent put a really, really crazy defense down. I put a pretty good defense down myself, and so uh, it's, it's a tricky one, though. My opponent is a fan of mine he has a crazy roster and i'll probably include some clips of just how good his roster is but he's got way more relic sixes than me way more re uh, way more relic sevens and eights and he has double the relic nines he's he's got everything and the only way i can even keep up at all on my roster is i have a few more zetas he has like 150 i have 200 ish so he, he has most of them but he's missing a couple key ones, of course, so I, I don't know. No excuses, obviously, but but there are struggles that are going on, and there's the, you know there's ups and downs. It's exciting. There's what's one big long clench. You guys thought my last GAC video was a lot of clenching, and and there was actually in the moment. But this one has this one takes the cake. This this one, it, I'm guessing this will be my my best match of the season if I had to guess. So. Uh, stay tuned for that. I I don't know how long it's gonna end up, <laughs> which is what she said. But uh, it's a, it's a good match, and yeah, three v three, man. It, it's it's very interesting because of the opportunities for theorycraft. There there's a lot of weird teams that I use here because because I need to use them, and uh, yeah, I'm I'm overall very proud of how I played. So let uh, I and I I do have one enormous blunder that may or may not sink me you guys will have to find out so before we go on guys do want to just spend one second here more than one second saying thank you guys so much to my patrons i'm gonna have to update this a couple of these guys dropped off or you know kind of downgraded whatever but it doesn't stop the fact that i am so so appreciative of you guys just every, every month most months <laughs> you guys uh, for a long time have been supporting me and I couldn't do what I do without your help uh, You guys are truly a godsend and I truly truly appreciate you. Thank you guys so much And let's see we need to oh, that's where it's okay <laughs> All right, well, one last thing guys. I, we're trying to mount the algorithm. It's working. We're getting so many more views and everything really appreciate all the support please just keep leaving those likes comments in the comment area help us get onto that algorithm you guys can check out the merch i even have a mount the algorithm shirt and we're getting more and more added to the store every day so please just check check it out um you know if you want to support the channel for not free there are a lot of options for that too with patreon and on twitch you can sub all these different things so that being said, folks, let's actually get you to the actual fighting and the replay of the finals of this week's GAC. We're almost to the point where you guys can see me as a rock star, if you're ready for it. <laughs> there I am. <laughs> this is when I was 22. This is like 14 years ago, 13 years ago, something like that. Here's me with my future wife. This is, uh, we... We didn't meet at this party. We were just uh, starting to get to know each other a little. I actually dated someone else from this party for a while first. But, um, yeah, this is me and my wife before uh, we were married and stuff. Before we were even together at all. Did I steal it from a gas station? Now, this is actually my friend's. He got super pissed at me because I punched holes in it to tie that string through. That you see? Like, because it was just hanging on the wall. And I was like, oh, he won't mind. And then, <laughs> narrator... <laughs> He minded. <laughs> he just did. <laughs> it was tough. All right, all right, guys. It's time time for my costume to be applied here. You're on your own for how? Thank you. <laughs> That's not going to be an option for very long. <laughs> well, Eventually, I won't be able to unwrinkle my brow. <laughs> when you're 90, I won't tell you to unwrinkle it. That'll be nice. There you go, costume. Hey, awesome. look, guys. I'm Harry Potter. <laughs> Thanks, hon. <laughs> there we go. 
The lightning bolts means I'm a whore crux of, of the Dark Lord. I'm a whore crux? Watch your mouth. <laughs> Just kidding. I, I know that it's it's literally impossible to watch your own mouth unless you do like unless you like puff out your lips. So, anyways, ch check this guy out, guys. Uh, lo look at his relic levels. It is it is like super intimidating, especially. But but his his mods are also really scary. So he's he's beating me in mods, not like dramatically, but enough that I, I really feel it. You know, like especially like the plus fifteens and up it is. It's a pretty big difference for me, uh, as, in terms of his advantage. He also, uh, look at his relics though. The thing that really, so, so like relic 9, 8, 7, it's like, oh, okay, like kind of an advantage, but not like this overwhelming one. Look at tier 6 though. That's where, uh, and then like tier 5, I'm ahead a little bit, but not, not by enough to make up for that tier 6. And then when you consider the seven, eight, nine, I'm. It it's when I was scouting him, I was like, "Geez, are all the characters he has relic seven? Uh, you know, or relic six? It's it's quite intimidating." He failed one on my general Skywalker, so I, I don't know exactly what he used. No no real clue, but I was happy to see this, uh, because now he's gonna have to use a real thing to beat him as well, like. I don't I don't know exactly what, but unless he wants to drop more banners, like General Skywalker is primed to steal a couple more, uh, even on a good team. So that's that's nice. And then I, I do have Padme here. I can't give my reasoning on why I put all these things down, guys. I'm sorry to say, but he got a 53 on my Lord Vader here. He got a 55 on my Darth Revan. Note that I did put Malak in here this time, and then a 53, I believe, on Asajj. Just like short for CK. Just call you. All right, so we've got Maul, Strawberry Head Maul lead with Sith. Um, a he put Treya on defense. He never, never, never does that, so I have no idea what to do there. Uh, Darth Revan, he usually puts Malak here. Doesn't put, didn't put Malak here this time, so this will be interesting to see if troopers can beat this. Uh, and then we have his Relic 9... Jedi Master Luke, with only five Zetas. And then a couple, like, relatively worthless Jedi. And it's like, I think he's trying to bait out my Sith Eternal, but I don't really know what I'd use my Sith Eternal for anyways, because my guess is that he'll put, like, Rey in the back with, with something that I can't really Sith Eternal anyways. I don't know. Alright, so... We'll put this on Dark Trooper. Dark Trooper punches Sith Empire Trooper. Gosh, that was not much damage, guys. That is pretty scary, actually. Um, uh oh, we could be in trouble, with that guys. Oh my gosh. Okay, yeah, I think we're in trouble. I think we're in trouble. Um, yikes. Okay, well we killed him. We we got that guy. Oh my gosh, we're we gonna do this. No! Okay. Okay, maybe we got it. Come on, Dark Trooper. <laughs> okay, well, <laughs> that's not what I was looking for, really. <laughs> Terrible banners, but... Alright, well, now we know. Three or even four punches do not kill that Sith Trooper. That is Sith Empire Trooper. That was scary. Not to mention, I mean, I have to feel like he's setting a trap for me here, but... I don't, I don't particularly, like, I, like, I think, I think we can fight our way out of a trap, especially if the trap is actually, like, part, setting the trap is part of, like, a galactic legend. I mean, th this is a e pretty even trade in terms of just total investment. So, we'll, we'll see how this goes, but... Um, I'm actually interested to see if we can... I'd like Barris to maybe survive after we do the big AoE. Um, well, here, let's, let's do this. We'll heal just a tiny bit more. Uh, that was probably unwise, actually, because he's going to get his ult here. I, I, wasn't, I wasn't moving at fast enough of a rate, but uh, we'll see. We'll just see how it goes. So, Ezra will fry at least... 
And then, yeah, I may as well just force drain him. I'm, I'm, what I'm trying to do here, guys, I'd like to just use basics to take out Luke here. And then maybe we can get to the point where we are able to... We're able to just get max banner, like get that extra bonus banner uh, from from protection. Or from whatever it's called. It looks like not. Oh, cool. Okay, that was exactly what I was hoping, that Barris would be just strong enough to withstand one of those. We get one of our banners back. There we go. You love the black box design. Yeah, I spent so little time working on it, really, but it's okay. So the idea here is every time these, uh, every time Dooku goes, uh, B One's gonna assist and hurt himself. So, I mean, we're not gonna get wonderful banners here. I, I have no illusions. Oh, uh, you know what? This might actually be a really bad because he's gonna be putting, what is this? Yeah, healing immunity on me until I take turns. So, so that's not great. But, we'll see, he's also going to be hurting himself every time he counters, so that that's good. Uh, let's see. Tell you what, can we just, like, kill Dooku here? There we go. Okay, so, uh, things are a little better now. And hopefully, hopefully we can actually just get Scion's protection up eventually. Let's see, we'll put this on you, um... So it, Nihilus is going to heal himself, but I want that, I want to be able to use that big hit from Scion as soon as I can. Okay, so we got, we got this thing here. What's on my forehead? Oh, you, you missed the start of the stream. My, uh, we got a decent hype train, so my wife uh, painted my head. We got, we, she gave me a, a Halloween costume. It, it's really good. I, I can tell you're impressed. As well you should be. You know what, I should have used that triple throw here. It's okay. Um, so now we're just going to try to try to bide our time on Zalbar until we get Scion to a place we want him. So Nihilus isn't at a place we want him, actually. His health needs to regen a little bit. Uh, let's see, we'll give this to Scion once again. Okay, I think we're at 52, folks, so we'll, let's just finish it. There we go. Um, all right. Let's let's just pull the trigger, guys. Let's see how this goes. This might this might just end super poorly, guys. I, I realize that, but we gotta we gotta get moving here. So, all right, they get their first turns and all that madness. Um, we're gonna save the we're gonna save all of the um. Because we could dispel things if we wanted to. We might as well just hit Sidious a little bit here. Okay, so now we have days. Everyone has days, so we can just shoot. And we'll just do an attack here. Um, let's see. So we can put everything, put all this stuff out. Um, now, we'll, now we'll try to dispel everything and heal up a bit, because now days is out. And the idea here is, hopefully, to just one-shot that Marauder right away. If that isn't available, we can one-shot someone else, I guess. See this. Gosh, yeah, that wasn't enough. <laughs> Uh-oh. Alright, well, we could... We might, be in, we might be in trouble. We'll see. They're doing some decent damage here, too, so I don't, don't necessarily love that. Uh, yeah, this this could absolutely be a mistake, guys. I'm feeling more and more like it's I'm on like the mistake uh, side of that belief. Oh my gosh, yeah, we're 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 not we're not doing well, guys. I wouldn't say wouldn't say that we're doing well exactly. Yeah, I, th I think we're I think we're just screwed actually. Oh, here we go. Okay, we can we can at least heal up a little bit. Um, okay. Keep going. We, we need to we need to take the, these other guys out besides Marauder guys is what we really need to do. 
I think that that's going to be an important part of all of this. So next time Spy gets a turn, I think we take someone out, is what I think. Come on! Yeah, we're, uh, we're not looking great here, folks. No! Yeah, we're not gonna kill Marauder here. I mean, maybe we are. Let's find out. Look at that. He dead. <laughs> See, I told you it was gonna work. <laughs> I mean, it was like, may as well just pull the trigger. Uh, you know, let's just do it. Okay. Who knows? We, maybe we maybe we end up with a 51. That, that would be kind of funny. <laughs> See? See, that was funny. I told you it was going to work. <laughs> oh my gosh. So, a couple hits from Cam. Another hit from Cam. Another big hit from Cam. Oh, that wasn't cool. Alright, I have to hit him because we've got that debuff. Um, let's do that hit here. Uh, let's see, we'll, we'll do the healing protection thing a little bit later if, if that's warranted. We're going to take out Nihilus first. Okay, nice. So, yeah, okay. Alright, does his AoE now. He didn't land anything. That's wonderful, actually. Okay, so that, that worked, at least. For good banners. See what's in the back. See what traps he's set for me. What's the offense on my cam? Uh, it's decent. I don't know. He's, he's Relic 8, so... Uh, with offense mods. I, th I think it's offense. What's he got in the back here? Okay, so he's got Ray. And he's got Lord Vader. And he's got Relic 8 on Chupio and, and CLS. Dear Lord. This is a pretty stacked back zone. And, uh... <laughs> yeah, this is a tough back zone, guys. <laughs> this is tough. This is really tough. I don't know what to do. I don't know if we're going to clear. Honestly, I think we just start by hitting Magna Guard. Like, I don't think there's much point in hitting Newt at all. Thanks, Geodude2000, for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Pay our extortion for now. I don't know if we should pay our extortion, honestly, because it's just going to make Django hit harder, but it's a man to do. See, that, that wasn't that wasn't a very hard hit by Django, frankly, against, against that K2. Like, fingers crossed. I mean, I don't mean to... I'm not saying that we, we're... It's definitive proof that we're just going to win, but it, it seems like... It seems like this might work okay. At least it's not speed GAC. Oh, I know. Well, yeah, we'd, we'd have already used our GLs by now. I mean, it'd be over by now, right? So. All right, let's take out Magna Guard here. And then I guess we may as well just shift focus to Jingo, right? Because Newt's not really hurting anyone, and Jingo's available for death. Jingo's like, <laughs> you might say, I might say the same about you. <laughs> We're kind of available for death, too. Oh, there's there's a big hit on Worthless Guy. Way to pull your weight, Worthless Guy. Okay, got our first kill on Jenga. That's, that's a good feeling. Keep setting us on fire. I don't appreciate that. Mon Mothma's not that bad, dude. 
Not that bad. She's kind of bad. Okay. All right. So now we got Newt. I think we can do it, guys. I think I think this is possible. Let's do let's do the big heal to try to get Mothra closer to that max here. Nice. Okay. So Newt just went. That's actually wonderful, because then, oh, I guess he gets an immediate bonus turn anyways. I don't know how that like sometimes. Sometimes he doesn't. I don't, I don't know how that exactly how that works. Uh, we can do this. We can promote everyone, her worthless guy at least. Nice, is that a 54? Wonderful. All right, theorycraft for the win. Ooh, we crashed. I mean, we got the win, but we crashed afterward. <laughs> That's kind of scary. There you go, Lomas McBardman knows his business. He says it might not work. Okay. So, we really want to stun B2 if possible. We're not getting the stun, unfortunately. Maybe we'll get the stun here. No. Okay, so they're going to dispel us here. Um, and... Uh, <laughs> and Aura has been permanently dispelled, so there's that. Um, and Mando might also permanently be dispelled here soon. We'll get our contract soon, hopefully. Not soon enough, damn it all. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we do this. Oh, look at this. Okay, okay. We might have play, folks. We might have play. So we're just doing this to get that extra crit for Mando. Yeah, she's going to hit me back, and then we're going to get sad. We did get a crit from that, though. Okay, if we survive this, then we might be okay. Oh, look at this. Look at this. <laughs> we did it. As long as we get that first turn. All right, so we can we'll do the AoE here. And then let's just try at least to reduce turn meter. No. Oh, except, and then he gains all the turn meter. Okay, so that, that was helpful. Very useful. Now he's, now he's back to full health. Glad that happened. That was, that was uh, worthwhile. Glad that happened. Uh, we can do this for a minute here. And the turn to this dude. Do another AoE. Okay, so Bam's gonna go. We'll go into poop stance here. Try to reduce the turn meter on this dude. All right, so he's not gonna get too many whistling birds, I think. Yeah, four whistling birds we should be able to handle. And now he shouldn't be able to get that automatic, that automatic thing. Let's see, okay, so these guys, it's gonna actually miss those two, the guys that matter a little bit. Um, shouldn't get the automatic turn meter for, for hitting him. So now, okay. All right. Um, let's do this for a minute. I'd, I'd prefer if he didn't hit me back. I mean, I guess he will when I don't have the strategic thing on, whatever it's called. Okay, we can't crit him, but we can still do enough damage. Solo's conservative and usually wins. Uh, yeah. No, Solo's a great player, guys. I... I am always appreciative of Solo's input. Even if it's not what I want to hear, sometimes, sometimes it's, uh, it's, I mean, a lot of times it's good for me to, to hear it, so. All right. Cool. All right, we gotta, gotta get, open this, the next of my uh, caffeinated fizzy waters here, guys. So it's faster than any of these noobs. So uh, we can get rid of the advantage on Hux. Oh, and then Hux got a turn, and then, uh-oh. Well, let's find out. See how this all works. Um, I just want to put the the debuffs and stuff on Chupio. So we can, we can do this. We can do that. And maybe take out Hux here. Let's just do a basic. Yes, okay, got Hux down. 
Um, now Red Trooper is our target. Let's switch stances here. All right. No problemo, guys. Well, look at that. He attacked, guys. He killed my final squad. I can show you what's in my back zone here. See if he took any more. I'm, I'm sure he just wiped, wiped the... Oh, look at that. He actually failed one more. I mean, he, maybe it was just a burner, but... I think I think this works, guys. Actually, I I, I might be foolish, but um, I think this works. Let's let's go. Who gets guard here? Um, probably Bo-Katan. Yeah. Okay, so we can do this. Dispel the nonsense. We get nine whistling birds here. We get 12, we get 14, 15, we have 15 whistling birds, guys. Let's see if we just kill his crew. Not quite. Damn it all. Didn't even put healing immunity on him, damn. Damn the man. We can actually hurt Kylo a little bit, though, at least. He's got the healing immunity. Might just be able to manage it here. Gosh, I don't like that. Um, okay, give this to her. She's about to die. And then... Maybe the AoE just kills OG Kylo? Yes, okay. Nice. Oops. Click that out of the game for a sec. We're good. Assuming we can actually apply healing immunity on him, we'll be good. There it is. Cool. Not the greatest of banners, but it worked. Okay, I'm, I'm sure he's got good ships back here, too. Yeah, Executor, of course. And Negotiator. Woo! Alright. Yay. Okay, so we want to target someone other than Luke here. Let me do this. Probably should have targeted Chupio, actually, but it's okay. So let's dispel this. We can do this. Um, let's see. Get the armor shred early. Okay, well, let's just do this because Thrawn's gonna go next. That's that's the most important part. Is Thrawn going next? Now we're gonna just we gotta we gotta hustle as well because this this can take a while. So it's gonna take a bit of time, folks. And maybe Thrawn just goes really soon anyways. We'll see. We'll just have to see, folks. All right, so we're starting to... Let's see. Thrawn has a ton of turn meter. Let's just take out all the turn meter now. Let's... Uh, we can do this. Maybe we're able to actually get the... Nice, we got days up. That's super nice. Uh, let's get another armor shred on Chupio. Let's just do this, trying to keep Thrawn's turn meter as low as we can. Gosh, look at how much damage Chupio is doing. Even with the, the damage negation. It's just scary, man. Okay, Thrawn's about to take a turn, so let's, uh, let's reduce that again. Reduce his armor a bit. Get rid of that, get rid of this. Does AoE, which is scary, because he's Relic 8. Dispel this. Gosh, with those three... Those three uh, things on Thrawn, it's, it's just... Uh, he can't hit back is the, the thing that scares me the most right now. Uh, but with all the armor shred on Chupio, we should be able to... Yeah, got him. Got him! Okay. So, oops, can't taunt. The, I mean, we, we can taunt to reduce Thrawn's turn meter at least, but the taunt didn't stick, I guess, is what I'm trying to say. 
Okay, so hand the turn to Gideon because he has a bunch of stuff. He's got a bunch of turn meter. Gideon may as well armor shred here because there's no... Uh, there, there, he, he has days. Oh, uh-oh. Okay, so Luke, Luke's loose, kind of. Though we can do more damage to him now, in fact. So that, that's kind of nice. Try to get days on him again. Got it. All right. There it is. 53, but I'll take it. Yeah, huge props to Byro, who, who invented that team, for sure. I have to kill Jin and I, Luke, before they go. Correct. So the idea is, Maul is just going to go... He'll get five stacks, and then he'll just hit Luke, hit Luke five times. Candorus will assist every single time. And hopefully he'll be dead by the time we do six hits. This is one of those things that's like, it would be really nice to test because you'd know immediately if it was going to work. Okay, so Shakti is all his the speed advantage. Yes, okay, okay. So now we have five stacks from Maul and Kandra should assist every time. Let's, let's find out if that's true. Nice. And every attack should do a little more damage. <laughs> like that. Alright, old Ben. Well played, old Ben. You did your job. As a tank, mission accomplished. Look at that, we have five stacks again. <laughs> old Ben's like, oh crap. <laughs> Uh, well, that was cool. Alright, so give this to you. And he's gonna do his his thing. And she's gonna do this thing. And then we'll call her just to dispel the nonsense. Some of it, at least. Um, You can do your taunt, I guess. I, I don't know. Give this to you. I'll tell you what, let's just call you, call himself just to get our ult a little bit closer. Try to take out Stormtrooper before they get another, to, like we don't want their, the healing immunity to stop working. Yeah, that wasn't, that wasn't great. Um, I can do this, probably should have put it on Clone Wars Chewie actually. All right. I don't know, I'm, I'm sure I'm making a lot of mistakes here, guys. So, no judgment, please. Come on, take out. There's got to take out Stormtrooper. That's that's all. Before he pops his ult, that would be so nice. Nice. Okay. So we'll get his ult here pretty soon. I think under his ult, he's immune to damage immunity or something. Oh, Clone Wars 2 is a little bit sad here. Um, you know what? I care less about Clone Wars Chewie, to be honest. Tell you what, he's immune to healing immunity while he's in his ult thing. Oh, there's our savior. There, okay, so ult thing done. There, you can taunt Clone Wars Chewie. He's actually lived for longer than I thought he would, guys. 
Gotta give him credit. Let's keep ramping. Keep ramping. Oh, maybe I should have done my big hit there, actually. That was potentially unwise, folks. Guess we'll see. Oh, there goes Chewy. And maybe there goes, um... I should have used it. Maybe. See it now. Yes! Okay. 49, but we still got it. Thank goodness. Oh, look, he attacked somewhere. We got a 56 somewhere, guys. Looks like he used Malak on a thing. Oh yeah, uh, I, it normally puts Malak with Darth Ver with Darth Revan, I, so yeah, that team becomes a liability. But uh, what's a man to do? John Jin, not old Ben, surely. Uh, you know, he doesn't have all of his Zetas or anything either on Ray, so that's nice. But yeah, I, I probably made a mistake. I mean, that's that's like granted. Uh, let's see. Mm. It really doesn't, it just doesn't matter. I should be just attacking L3 is what I should do. Uh, right now, why, why don't we just start doing that more. More and more, we'll just attack L3 for a bit. Okay, so, we got that to happen. Do the AoE, that sucked, but we'll hit Ray. Um, whoops, okay. Doesn't really matter, we just want to get our ultimate as quickly as we can at this point. So we just, oops, should have hit Ray there. So that was a mistake. Okay, so hopefully Luke gets a turn and can pop his ult before. Yeah, okay. That'll help. Just stun Vander for fun. I uh, can get ability block on people. Okay, so she does. Oh my gosh, that hit. I did not think that was going to kill me. Holy balls. That uh that ruins it, guys. Ah, oh, we had we had such a good run going. I don't think we have anything that finishes her off. Maybe like Vader or something. Yeah, we're we're definitely in danger, guys. Okay, so we got her in healing immunity or damage immunity at least. I don't I don't think we can I mean it'd be nice if we can at least kill L3 right but I don't think we can but we're good. we can try solo says kill Vander I don't think I can Yeah, I, I just don't think we can do it, guys. I didn't, I didn't think she'd be able to one shot. I must have ramped up her mastery too much with old Ben <laughs> or something. Well, well, guys, that was uh, that was negative. <laughs> okay, so hit Houndstooth here. Okay, the the second best option. I kill that vulture. That's that's fine. Um, I mean, we still want turn meter here, so we're still gonna dispel, even though there's nothing to dispel. I mean, we do this, and then they dispel all their things, their buzzies.
Because they're, they're all going to take their turns right now. Makes me think we just do a basic here. Maybe I'm wrong about that. Alright, so Buzz Droid. Our Vulture's gone. TIE Fighter's gone. Okay, now we see if we get Xanadu Blood to be targeted, maybe we'll be okay. Maybe we'll be okay. Maybe we won't. Wrong ship, guys. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I fear for us, folks. I fear for us. But we're gonna keep going. Look at that silencer first. Interesting. Oh, no one assisted. That was cool. I mean, it makes sense, I guess. Um, do the AoE. Maybe the AoE. No, we wanted to summon a vulture at least for this. Oh my gosh. Okay, yeah, we're, uh, we could be in huge trouble, guys. Could be in huge, huge, huge trouble. Oh, they got their contract and everything. Have to do a basic there. Yeah, I think, I think we're in huge trouble, guys. Um, but we don't have Breach on us right now. So we can dispel this stuff. We'll just do... Hmm? Tell you what, I don't want to get rid of all those buzz droids. Or they real buzz droids. Yeah, it says that they're real. Oh yeah, so he's gone. I think... Yeah, I think we're in huge trouble, guys. Oh, Spy's gone. Uh-oh. And they're taunting. Yeah, we're... <laughs> we will not survive this. I don't think I've ever gotten this destroyed before. Damn it all. Um. Alright, we, we, we're gonna bum rush Razor Crest if we can, guys. <laughs> and we can't. Okay, well, maybe we get lucky and take out some Houndstooth. Oh, come on, he dodged! No! Oh, you're kidding me. Oh my gosh, he dodged. That is so upsetting, guys. I uh, Come on, Houndstooth, take a turn and die. Yes, okay, Houndstooth is gone. Okay, we got Houndstooth, guys. We did it. Kind of. Um, maybe we get lucky and kill Razorcrest too. Who's going next? I think we do the AoE and just try to take out these two. Dodged again on Razorcrest. No! <laughs> At least we got, alright, we got a couple ships out. Yeah, those double critical dodges didn't do me any favors, did it? <laughs> it's just, just so frustrating, guys. All right, so let's see. Yeah, so we mark him, and okay, this this will probably just quote unquote kill him. Oh, here we go. Boom. <laughs> Sometimes that works. <laughs> that was good RNG, but that that was pretty cool. All right. Mm. Okay, may as well just cleanse Falcon here. Yeah, you always take that when you can. Oh, that was pretty cool. Alright, let's see if we can just focus down this this dude here. There we go. Um. Let's get rid of that target lock on Bistin. On Bystan. Alright. I'm not saying it's completely over, but... It's completely over.
Maybe that'll work. Who knows? <laughs> All right, so we're gonna hand this to Silencer here. Silencer is just gonna destroy him. Excellent. Um. Oh look, we finally got a turn. I guess we'll put this on you because he's our one option because he's taunting right now. And I don't know. So you he'll miss, but then Silencer gets to shoot. Doesn't get to do anything because he's tenacity and stuff. Oh, here this dispel is nonsense. That seems like fun. That seems like a neat trick, a good trick. Oh, uh, let's see. Let's start to stun. This dude. Try to stun this dude. Nice. Um. Hey, well, let's get rid of that evasion just because it pisses me off. That's all. That's the only reason, guys, is because it pisses me off. Nice. Okay. Got him. Now we're just gonna keep calling Silencer to do his to do his business. All over the this executor comp. At least we killed Houndstooth. That was kind of a random kill toward the end. I was feeling hopeless. And then it, it panned out. Oh, let's see. Yeah, let's, we can just do this. Not afraid. There we go. 41, I mean... Isn't that wonderful? It worked out, though. So I, I, <laughs> if this General Skywalker beats my Kylo, even though Kylo's modded poorly, then we all know that General Skywalker is going on offense now. Okay, so let's uh, let's hand the turn again so that we can just get rid of a lot of protection here. Just try to kill fives as quick as we can. And, uh, let's see. We'll try to do this, because Hux will get another turn at least. Well, looks like Kylo will. Nice. Okay. Uh, may as well just reduce his mastery a bit. For fun. Reduce his being alive a little bit as well, I think. As soon as we can. I think this is it. This is our cue for him to stop being alive. Okay, well, there it is, folks. No full clear, but he put the most middle finger defense down he could. And with, uh, I think he, I, I actually, so guys, I think he tree was trying, he's trying to win. And he may end up winning. I, I don't know. If he can one-shot my executor, that, that takes... That puts a lot of pressure on me suddenly again. But we, we did what we could. And well, we fought our best. I think, think this was pretty good. Uh All right, folks. We have the results. So let's... Uh, I thought my opponent wouldn't be able to clear my bottom zone. And I guess we'll find out if that is accurate or not. Suspense. And the tragic news, folks, is that he indeed was able to clear my back zone. So let me, let me show you the results here. You guys can see my defenses. Uh, it took four to get through General Skywalker. He, he was so methodical here. I mean, he, he reached out. He changed his defenses dramatically uh, against me. Um, it, it really irks me that I lost this, frankly, guys. So he, he failed once against Jedi Knight Luke, but then he one-shot everything, and he got decent back. I guess a couple of them he got, like, a 48 against. <sighs> guys, I'm not happy. This I, I thought I thought we were going to be okay. Uh, he he one-shot all my, all my stuff up top here. I He switched a couple key things that I think... I think changed it. You get a 56 on my pad on my Barris squad. I, just frustrating because he, he never does. He when people change things, when good players change things that like they they never ever ever do when you're scouting, like it can mess with you. So he also one shot my executor. I 
I am not convinced. People say that Scimitar is good here. I think it sucks. I think it blows. This isn't why I lost. Like, this isn't why I lost. So, whatever. I'm I'm just, like, I'm still angry. So, <laughs> anyways, he, he beat me. Fair square. Like, you know, huge props to him. No no shade at all. Um, but, but, yeah, we... It's just frustrating, guys. Just frustrating. One shot my fleet. And that was that. Um... I don't know what to say. I, I thought that I played well. I think I needed I needed more than just my leftover Jedi. The biggest mistake, guys, the biggest one was putting old Ben in here. I thought that having a tank would be nice, but I think every time that the damage was done to me, he's gaining turn meter every time. Like it's not not good. Like she's gaining all this mastery and she just one shot old Ben. Like it you know. It just made her too strong, and I think that if we hadn't had that ramping, I think we would have had a better chance. Like, her ultimate just ending me derailed me to the point where I couldn't do anything. So, um, yeah, I wish I wish it had gone better, folks. Obviously, it, it would have been nice. But having said, I I played I played pretty well. He put a good defense down. He he managed to get through mine. So kudos to him. And I guess I need to get better defense or something. Um, yeah, so we go to five and one, and hopefully we don't lose any more this season. We'll see. Guys, thank you all so much for watching, and remember that in all things, Zareth prevails. <laughs>